So guys, I am in Manchester for my first content creators event. Um, I came here super early. Um, An event starts by 11 o'clock to 3 o'clock. It's just it's 3 to half 3. It's a long story. I definitely will update you guys. But yeah, I'm trying to look for a cafe to go sit and have like something little to eat, something light before the event starts. Because I'm not sure if there's refreshments or not. And your girl has to always come correct. So yeah, let's go. Baby, you don't know what you do to me. Between me and you, I feel a chemistry. I won't let no one come and take your place. Cause the love you give, you can't be replaced. So no one else can do That's why I'm fine. I'm fine. and some hot chocolate i've taken pictures contents obviously as you know um, i'm going to sit here for a while so the event starts by 11 so i would and it's literally like maybe five six minutes seven minutes max away from here so i'll just sit down here for a few minutes until maybe 10 50 then i'll walk to the place and yeah let's see what the event holds for us with my look in the comments <laughs> I should I with my makeup? I'm actually shocked, but I need to practice more. I hope that you guys can hear me though. Um, oh yeah, let's try the hot chocolate. Oh. Yeah. 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 So guys, I'm done at the cafe and I will be heading to the venue soon. So right now it is currently 10.40. And I'll be heading to the venue soon. I can already see like people posting on their Instagram stories and everything. But yeah, we're close by, so that's a good, good one. I will leave here in 10 minutes. I just still want to chill for a bit. Then I will take my time to walk to the venue. Yeah, so it was really nice. The croissant. I've not had croissant like that. It was good. Everything was good. The service, everything was good. It was perfect. I really enjoyed myself. And anytime I come into Manchester again, I definitely will stop by and try something else. So yeah, let's head to the event. I'm super happy. And I hope it's just worth it, like everything. You know, waking up early, waking up early and everything, I hope it's actually worth coming down here. Um, and I hope that this volume is picking up something. I need to check. But yeah, see you guys when we get to the venue. Uh, I should have given from the best of me. I will wait, I wasted the best of me. Oh, baby, you don't care. Can't I be the loosest? This is her. Things are still real shit. Oh my god, no wonder, oh my goodness, I was on the wrong 
Okay, so it's just straightforward. It's just straightforward. I literally tapped the wrong icon. I don't know if you guys can see, but I was on this. I was on this. I actually tapped this instead of this. <laughs> that makes sense. I tapped the wrong icon. So I was wondering, like, why is he showing me this for? It's just a straight walk down to the venue. Um, so it's holding as a house of food. So this is basically like my first content creation. Apart from YouTube uh, events that I've attended, this will be the first event that I'm attending um, here in the UK. Um, yeah, so as we said already, this is the year of solo. Ordinarily, I would have not gone for this event because I don't know anyone there and I don't know anyone going. But I want to push myself to see. I've always said it. Like I want to do things differently and see why there literally will be no change. Like there's no way, you know. And earlier the better. So I signed up for a few things that I'll be going alone this month, January and next month. Um, the goal is to actually meet people, even if you don't have like, and you don't know anyone, but you definitely know people when you get there, which is key. So I am literally walking down. And I'll see you guys at the venue. So make sure you sign up for things like literally go out and explore. I love the sun at this corner. It's so nice. <sighs> okay. Enough talking. I'll see you guys when I literally get there. How long can you go, baby? At last, till my body's so amazing. Two 
I have the relevant influences which are ridiculous and marketing switches which have been operating since April 2020 and then the relevant tool that has been operating since 2021. In a nutshell, I do everything in social media. I have another business where I represent influencers, I've got a coaching business and everything needed. What would have to happen? Brand would have to happen. Granted, there'd be less campaigns to go, but because every 16 year old girl nowadays wants to be the next one made, there are so many creators that are offering. 50 pictures and 75 videos for a lip gloss. Yeah. I'm sorry. What is this? So we have to really start considering ourselves as the brand of the says we've got to give you this and in return we want this. Those are the deliverables of the campaign. And you need to turn and say whether you can shout them away back to you. You know, thanks so much. I'd love to discuss this further. Can you please let me know the idea that you really want to take that on to have the higher up or to have that one stop. Now I'm not saying don't work around with the creators, there are a number that I still do, but you have to really start to think that <laughs> 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 Instead, um, that's unhealthy brands, for the brands. I mean, say, um, you know, I've recently been advised that um, this breach mindset of property rights, and what I do is she took down like some of the up for, um, so that we can agree to a mutually beneficial compensation agreement. <laughs> <laughs> so guys we literally just went on break um the first session was really really interesting i learned a lot um a few things i think mostly one of the things that really caught my eye was contract so the person that um, lorella she spoke to us and it was basically about like as a background she's a lawyer career um her professional background she's a lawyer so it was easy for her to like dive into ugc um, contracts the legal part of it so i picked a few things in my notes which i've written down um yeah and i would say for now it's interesting meeting new people finding about their content creation journey and just knowing that you're not alone there's just that thing that comes with community which i really really like and i hope to i can't wait for the other sessions anyway to hear what the other speakers have to say and i'm super super excited and yeah the day is still young it is currently 12.50 focus because it's currently 12.58 so it's almost one o'clock and we are still here it's supposed to end by half three i think so um yeah i just got this cooking this um, i'm thinking of going upstairs for a drink but because it is that time of the month i'm not sure i need to drink anything especially with the hot um the hot chocolate i had at the cafe i think i'm done with sugar sweet things today so i basically want to go and get water or i don't know flavored water or something that doesn't have sugar anyway so i'll go upstairs and get that before we continue because my throat is getting dry I'm getting dehydrated but this is really nice <laughs> trend yourself there's no harm in you actually manipulating a trend and finding how it actually works best for you so it's trying to look at things in a different light and i think that's one of the big things that i've learned from steve and also what really helps to accelerate your audience i always give the example of like when the barbie movie came out but obviously i could not jump in that so guys we finished from the event it was super super fun it is literally 503 right now and we're taking pictures, making videos. Um, yeah, it was really, really good. 
um, when I get home, I'll just let you guys know as regards the um, amount I paid and really like just a review of what the event was, being my first one. Um, but yeah, I'm at the coach station. My coach is supposed to be for half seven because initially this was supposed to end at half six. So I bought my tick, my coach ticket for half seven. Um, I'm trying to see if I can get an earlier bus or coach back to Bradford. So I don't have to wait here for about two hours. Hopefully I'm able to achieve that. And if not, I have to wait, but I've done it before and it happened. So I'll just go and check if there are any buses going to Bradford and see if it's not fully booked and beg the driver to let me get on one. Um, but yeah, I'll see you guys when I get home. I'll let you guys know in details like how the event went and it's a good way to start the year, the month, because this year we're doing things differently. You already know I've said this countless times, but yeah, let us see how we can get home and I'll talk to you guys soon. Still try to come back when you think I always want to do but stay So guys I literally just checked the board and I can see that there's a bus or there's a coach to leave for 610 and there then after that the next bus is actually mine for half seven to Bradford but I doubt they will allow me to get on the 610 bus because that goes to Leeds and my ticket is for Bradford. I will try because when I get to Leeds I'll actually now have to get a bus to Bradford. I don't know if it makes more sense to just wait here for my Bradford bus. I think that makes more sense. But waiting for two hours because it's currently um it's currently 5 13. <coughs> Gosh. So I have to wait for about two hours plus in the coach station. <sighs> but um now oh my god so I think I'll just give my review of the content creation events for today because I will get home very late and I'm not sure I will be able to give the review again. So um, it started really nice. All the speakers were very, they, they gave valuable information. I learned a lot. Um, I liked that the session had times where we could network. So we spoke to different creators, their niches. And I actually learned a lot. If there's something I'll take away from today's event is that I learned so much. Um, about the one of the speakers, the first person that spoke to us, Lorella, her, she talked about she actually is a lawyer, so she talked about the contract and the legal side of UGC and content creation in general. So I picked a lot of tips from that. And the next person that spoke to us, um, Polly, also provided like very valuable information, which was really good. And I met a lot of other girlies that are in fashion, age, skincare. I even met someone in Leeds. You know, that I've been searching for a content body like around Bradford of it. Someone that I could meet up weekly for like coffee dates, content creation days. So that's a plus. Like I'm super excited about that. Um, so the plan we all tried to connect because where we went to was like a basement down. So there was actually no internet there. It was really dodgy, but we would connect and um yeah the plan is to meet and take it from there right so i'm really really happy it was really really good um so when i bought my ticket it cost about 70 pounds but um she later discounted it for about 40 pounds um so i had to go and meet up with her to just let her know and she was like yeah send her an email tomorrow and that she'll make a refund of the difference which is about 30 pounds which i'm happy about because yeah <laughs> Any money that comes back in is good money. You know, any sort of income is still money, it's income. Anyways, it's money we're not really expecting. So it's gonna come back in, which I'm super excited about. Um and yeah, birthday is next week. So I literally from this we jump into birthday planning. The content part of it is there, then the actual celebration, how I want to do my whatever I want to do is also there. So yeah. Um it was really a nice day. I'm super happy and I'm glad that I came glad that i pushed myself so this is your sign to literally push yourself like don't be scared this is, was it saying on tiktok last year the fear of looking stupid is holding you back so if you have that content posted if you want to create that content posted if you have an event you want to go to but you just feel like oh you don't know anybody there or there's no one to go along with you just go you will meet people like I left my house alone, but I met a lot of girlies. We connected, and you know, yeah, we definitely take it from there. Like 
you could get deals like I got from last year because I went for a few events and the momentum or the plan is to keep going and keep doing better so yeah enough yapping yapping um, I'll see you guys tomorrow possibly because today is already done um, tomorrow the plan actually is to go and check a few hotels I hope I get the strength to stand up for I plan to go check out these hotels to see which I would literally want to use for my bed station because the plan is to get like a hotel that chill um, so that's the plan for tomorrow but, but I'll let you guys know what the plan actually is and if not tomorrow as the vlog continues if you have been here up to this point be sure to smash the like button subscribe to my channel I'll put on the notification bell beside it so YouTube advise you when I post my content and yeah thank you guys for you know staying to this point and for watching my videos I love you you got something real life, babe I'm the only one You won't be able to stop Yes, I'm hurting, yes, I'm jaded Most of these things I don't want to say I won't be around while you chase You won't hear me up when you make me Don't try and come back when you So that brings us to the end of today's morning routine and I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye. A few moments later. Which of us was on the no spend January train? I was, but guess who? Oh, <laughs> Anyways, I'm going to be unboxing these items. That's why I said to come here and share with you guys. Let's go. So I'm going to be starting with this sauce. Um, my birthday is literally on the 25th and today is the 24th and I decided to buy some dresses. So let's, let's unbox together. Starting with... So I have a couple of dresses here. Everything is not for the birthday. In particular, I have some other things I need to do for... Yeah, I'm going to... Let's unbox the package from Pretty Little Baby. It's huge, I know. It's huge. Um, if you open it up. And it to open. This has been very, very helpful. Get yourself some. I'm not struggling anymore. Okay. What did I buy here? Okay, I bought um, a few things from Potato Chicken. So this should be pants, like a flare pants. Yeah. I always want to do, but it's dangerous. You got something real, not basic. You want to get with me, stop. done something from the bureau i just got my nails done i am currently in city center and it's very prep time so i've done my nails did my pedicure and obviously white as usual love 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 um i need to get like flowers and the cake because tomorrow is my birthday <laughs> this birthday feels very different it's a solo birthday celebration and i am not traveling so it's just I don't know, I just want to mark it or celebrate it somehow. Um, so I'm in city center now, I'm trying to look for where to get flowers. Just something small that can work. So I want to take some photos today that I will try to post tomorrow. 
so yeah it's birthday prep let's head to the flower shop So something like this one. left um, i just left a particular store and so they I don't have them arranged together as a bunch but you can buy past them she said it depends on the one you want to get so i looked at the red rose um that's 350 past them and to make like a nice bouquet you need to have like about 10. so if you say 10 times 350 that's a, that's about 35 pounds whereas you can have a bunch of flowers that are already tied together in the average store for about i don't know but I want to go and check the mall and look for other flower shops where I can already see flowers that are already arranged. I think that would be more cost effective. Because honestly, apart from photos and just putting them somewhere until they die off, we don't have much use for them. So I'm not expecting to do that. Yeah, let's go to the mall and see what we can find. Let's check the card factory shop. Thinking of getting my candles eventually for my cake. Um, let me see what they have. Okay. Let's see what I could do. Lots of Valentine's things going on. <laughs> Sorry, SL20. Just one year. 